Hey everyone, it's Alicia from A Music Vlog Yeah, and I'd like to welcome you to our interview with Girl Band. Hey guys. How's it going? How are you doing? Good. Pretty good. Glad to hear it. This is your first time gracing Canadian soil. So what was your first impression of Toronto and us Torontonians? It was kind of like a, we had like a six hour drive <laughs> that day, so I don't think we really kind of got to see the proper side of Toronto this year, but so far everyone's been lovely and friendly. And yeah, I really like it. I'm glad to hear it. And how are you actually enjoying the city so far? Because you've been here for, what, a couple days now? No, we just got into town like yesterday, yesterday afternoon. Right? We were actually late as well. <laughs> so like, we, it's, it's all been pretty rushed. But yeah, everything's been cool so far. You know, it's, it seems nice. And how was the show last night? It was really good. Yeah. Nice. It was like, we heard from the Viet Cong guys that the garrison was like a great place to mm -hmm. go. It was really cool. It was very loud. And... Um, yeah, and people seem to like it. That's happy. Eh? That's a good sign. Yeah. <laughs> You're playing the Drake tonight, which is one of my favorite venues in the yeah. city. So that's going to be a really, really good show. I'm we're pumped for that one. Cool. Yeah. So just as far as coming to Toronto goes, you actually played some shows with Viet Cong right before coming over. So how did those go over for you? Yeah, really good. Like they're like wonderful people. So like it was fun to like go to a few cities that we hadn't done before, and obviously like they'd pull a crowd there, and yeah, it was fun. They're a great band. So. You can't really go wrong. Yeah. <laughs> and being that you're here for NXNE, it's one of the bigger festivals in Toronto. So just what's your favorite part about actually playing festivals and festival season? I like just kind of, just, you kind of have no sense of time. You kind of just walk around aimlessly and, and I like that and kind of just stumble upon things. There's no kind of set plan and I like that. Yeah. And just on the music front, you're of course working on a new record, which we are really excited for. So how's that coming along? We finished it up recording and mastered and everything um, so yeah, it's, gonna, like, it's gonna come out later in the year I so think October like is the day you're looking at right or the month kind of almost. <laughs> <laughs> we're like confirming all that yeah all yeah. okay yeah um, but yeah it's just like we're just glad to have it done like we're really happy with it it feels a little funny to ha have it actually finished and no one's heard it but um yeah we're just looking forward to like there you go <laughs> Yeah. Well, you have an EP out and a couple of singles. So was this new record comprised of songs off of EPs, or how, how fresh is the new material? The, the LP is all new. All new tracks. Yeah. And how long have you actually been working on that for, then? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> some of the songs, if it's like, some of the songs, like, are really, really new. Like, we've only just finished them. And, like, one of the songs is, like, two or yeah. three, three years old. Yeah. Like, okay. so it's... It's all relatively new. Yeah. It's exciting. We can't wait to hear the stuff. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's our Thank pleasure. You. And as I mentioned to you before the interview, we actually feature a ton of awesome Irish acts. So my personal favorites having to be Otherkin, Hudson and Taylor. So for you guys, uh, who are some acts you'd recommend from either Dublin, Ireland that you'd like our readers to check out? Uh, Jet Setter. They're like our really good friends of ours. And the kind of the guitar based music is really good. There's a great band called 39 Sex, so I don't think we're going around anymore, but they um, have a song called The IRA, Think I'm Gay, which <laughs> is pretty good. <laughs> and then, um, like, our Melty Brains, uh, a practice place room with us, they're really cool. And Paddy Hanna, who we really, really like, is uh, like the singer song. Yeah, we actually one. just premiered oh, one of oh. his new tracks. Oh, yeah, 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 so yeah. that's awesome. Yeah, Paddy's great. Yeah. Well, it's obvious here that a uh, girl band is comprised of all guys, but who are some female artists that you actually enjoy listening to? Yeah, I listen to a bit of uh, Kate Bush. Okay, nice. Yeah, Babushka. And how about yourself? <laughs> yourself, female artists. Um, I was listening to that, uh, that PJ Harvey record, Let England Shake, a lot recently, which is fantastic. We need that Patti Smith as well. Oh, yeah, I just saw Patti Smith a few weeks ago, nice. which is wonderful. <laughs> I love Patti Smith. And then, like, uh, we listen to a bit of Shania Twain. Really? Oh, no, keep it mixing up. <laughs> Last time yeah. we were listening to a lot of Cheryl Crow. <laughs> Cheryl Crow. You guys yeah. are going, like, old, s yeah. old school. That's yeah. good. Sugar Babes. Yeah. Nice. All good. <laughs> I love that. And then outside of music, because it's obviously something that all bands bond over, um, what's something that you all enjoy doing together? Like, some of your hobbies as a band. Oh, right. And... Um, we tried to play football once and we all just like collapsed in the <laughs> corner. We played that band Melty Brains of football and just like, hideously lost and realized how like out of shape. So we probably should take up, start taking up more hobbies together. <laughs> like, get some get some workouts in there. Yeah. As opposed to just sitting in a van yes, eating yeah, hummus. Our main so. hobby is sitting, <laughs> sitting down together. <laughs> eating and not speaking. <laughs> <laughs> what do you kind of do to pass the time when you're on those long van drives? Because I know those can be pretty... 
pretty tedious. Like and of, like, lists of stupid nicknames <laughs> for each other, yeah. you know. Uh, I just I sleep. Yeah. I spy? Yeah. Dara just sleeps the whole way. <laughs> Never met him. How fun's I spy, though, when you're moving, and by the time you're at the next light, it's like, it's your thing's gone. Yeah. It keeps things fast, you know. It's pretty difficult in the desert as well. Like, I spy <laughs> something brown. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty much like that. Yeah. <laughs> well, to wrap things up, for our readers at home, uh, just tell them something about the band that most of them wouldn't know yet. Adam once ate an entire pineapple through the skin on his own sober. How did that go over? Sober? Yeah, completely yeah, sober. <laughs> Yeah, All right, that definitely works. That no Beautiful. Yeah. Well, that, <laughs> that wraps everything up. Just a massive, massive thanks to Girl Band for your Thank time you today. No it's our pleasure. And remember, everybody, you can visit us at www.amusicblogger.com for all exclusive interviews and features with your favorite artists. We will see you next time.